Hello, you are welcome to Operation 4.0 DPE Online Tutorials. Don't forget to subscribe, watch, share the link, and leave a comment for us to give you more. Today we are faced with a word problem, and I've just written out the details, but the whole question will be posted on your screen for you to watch. It says that Isaac has a utility function of u u of x y equal to x y plus s plus two y. It means that Isaac consumed two goods x and y, and the price of x is two, price of y is five, and his income is given by ninety one. The requirement for this particular question is for us to use Kramer's rule to solve this problem. So today, what I want to focus on is how to use Kramer's rule to solve a system of equation. So the first thing we're supposed to do here is to make sure that we get some equations that will help us to cast it into, into matrix form. So what I'm going to do is first to set the budget constraint, which is given by I equal to PX, X plus py y it means that price of x times quantity of x consumed price of y times quantity of y consumed equal to your income so your total expenditure should be equal to income so from here our income is 91 and it's equal to the price of x is 2 and the quantity of x consumed is s you don't know plus the price of y is 5 and the quantity of y consumed is y so this is our budget constraint and we can name this equation one so our focus is to get a, a set of equation which we can cast to matrix form so our second focus is to go to our utility function and then we we use what we call the equimaginal principle equimaginal principle to get our second equation so what we we'll do is that we are going to find the marginal utility of x which is given by partial differential of the utility function respect to x and when we do that we are going to have y plus 1 then we find marginal utility of y which is given by u partial differential of the utility function respect to y so we are going to have what so when you differentiate this you're going to have x plus 2 so that is that is what you have and from the equimaginal principle we know that mu of x over price of x should be equal to mu of y over price of y we are going to put the values and then the equation we've gotten into this particular one so mu of x is y plus one and the price of x is two should be equal to m u of y is x plus 2 over price of y is 5 so what we need to do is to cross multiply so we're going to have 5 y plus 1 equal to 2 x plus 2 then we're going to have 5 y plus 5 equal to 2 x plus 4 so what we need to do is that we we bring the constant to this side and send to the other side send all the variables to the left hand side so we're going to have minus 2 x plus 5y equal to 4 minus 5 so we're going to have minus 2s plus 5y equal to minus 1 and we can name this equation 2 so now we have two equations so this is what we're going to cast into matrix form and use Kramer's rule to solve so we can refer to our video on how to cast a set of equations into matrix form for it for you to be helped so when we cast this matrix so we're going to have 2 5 and then minus 2 5 x and y equal to 91 and minus 1 we have the coefficient matrix we have the variable matrix and we have now we have the constant matrix now what we need to do now is to find the solution to x and y using Kramer's rule and from the Kramer's rule says that if you want to find x then you should find determinant of a subscript s over determinant of a then if you want to find y it should be a subscript y over this so we need to find the determinant of 
our A matrix here. Then we also find our A substitute A substitute Y. We find their determinants and then we can find our solution. So the first thing is to find determinant of A. Should be equal to 2, 5 minus 2, 5. So if you do it, we're going to have 2 of 5 minus, minus 2 of 5. Then you're going to have what? 20. So the determinant of A is 20. So the next thing you need to do is to find A subscript X, the determinant of. Now, how do you get A subscript X? It means that you should replace the first column in your coefficient matrix by your constant matrix. So we are going to replace 2 minus 2 here by 91 and minus 1. So it gives me 91 minus 1, 5, 5. Now find the determinant of this. I'm going to have 91 times 5 minus 5 times minus 1. Then we're going to have, so when you do it and do it, we are going to have 460. And S becomes uh, so I'm going to have 460 over 20 which is my determinant of A then I'll get so first I'm, I'm going to get 23 then I'm also going to find Y so A subscript Y is given by replacing the second column from our coefficient matrix by the constant matrix. So when we do it, we're going to have 2 minus 2, 91 minus 1. So we are going to find the determinants. We are going to have 2 of minus 1 um, minus 91 of minus 2. So we're going to have 180. Then our y becomes which is given by 180 over 20 and our answer is 9 so x y becomes 23 and then 9 so this is how you can use Kramer's rule to find solution to a set of problems don't forget to subscribe to this channel share the link and leave a comment for us to give you more See you next time.